Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Derek, man. I want to talk to you about something that's kind of a lesson that I learned uh, through my life. I, I tell you a lot about the lessons I learned, man. I've gone through so much in life that I just feel like it's something I have to share. I have so many life lessons that really has helped me become a better person, helped me think different, helped me as a business person. And also it's kind of like my ministry of what I do and my training. Uh, today, I mean, you know, we go through so many things in life that we don't really understand why we go through it. So much pain, you know, so much discouragement, uh, the, a life where we just don't feel like it's fulfilling. And it just seems like it's so much negative going on in our life. Well, you know, I, I something that you don't know about me, I used to be a big time complainer. I used to always complain about negative things and all the stuff that was happening in my life. And like, it really just ticked me off that I was going through this. And I just, I always wonder like when things gonna get better. I always believed that it would, I just didn't know when it would. So, but, I started getting out of these negative situations when I started looking at it different. And today, that's what I'm gonna talk to you about. To understand that what seems negative and what seems like something's bad is not bad. As far as my life goes, there's no such thing as a negative. There's no such thing as bad. Because if you look hard enough and deep enough to any situation, you'll always be able to find something good. And you know, once I start doing that, then my life became so positive. You know, a lot of my clients, a lot of people I deal with, they always talk about how positive I am. And I tell them, man, if you had known me 5, 10, 15 years ago, you would have never made that statement because you would have been like, man, he complains about everything. And, and I did. And I believe that my football career was taken away from me uh, because of the attitude that I took toward the negative things. And, you know, the last negative thing for my career was my knee injury. Uh, but I think that, you know, along the way, uh, God kind of showed me, you know, how to look at life and, and stop looking at it from a complaining standpoint. So, you know, today I want to tell you, stop complaining. Stop complaining about what's going on in your life. Start looking deeper. First of all, be thankful for what you do have. Be thankful that life is not as bad as it could be. There's a lot of bad things going on in people's lives that if you had to experience, you would probably feel even worse. So the first thing I would tell you is start looking for the being thankful for what you do have and, and thankful that things are not worse than what it is. After you do that, you have to start looking deeper into your negative situations because just like when you go into the gym, you're gonna go through some struggle. If you if you you know that you're going to the gym to get better, you you know running uh, is hard. Whether you're doing cardio on the treadmill, whether you're outside, whatever, running is hard. So you you really want to uh, understand that when you're going to the gym, there's going to be struggle. There's going to be pain. If you do not expect that, get your butt out the gym because you're not gonna accomplish anything, you're just gonna be wasting your time. But if you understand that the struggle and the pain you go through is gonna make you better, then that's when you will consistently keep going in the gym because you will look at the pain as something good. I always tell people pain is your friend. It is not your enemy. If you're experiencing pain in the gym, that means you're getting better. So stop running away from the struggle. Understand that there will be struggle. So if you go into the gym understanding that struggle is better for you, you will take that same mindset into life. Understand that there is struggle in life. But if you look deep enough and hard enough, you understand that that struggle is something good in it. There's always something good in it. I didn't realize that back in the day, but now I've gone through so many negative things that always turn out positive that I, I finally made the statement, there's no such thing as a negative in my life. I don't care what it is, there's always something good. You just have to look deep enough, you know? If you go into a mine and you look at the walls, you may not see anything, but if you start deep digging into that wall and the deeper you get, you start finding precious diamonds. And guess what? You're not gonna just go in there and just pull that diamond out of that out of those walls. You're gonna have to dig and chop and, and break up stuff to get to that diamond. So it's the same thing in life. Your life is a diamond, but you have to dig deeper through all the chaos and all the mess in this world 
that maybe you had nothing to do with or maybe you brought upon yourself. But start looking deeper into these situations so you can become stronger and you become a better person. You know, everybody wants their life to be different. They want to change, but they don't, nobody want to be different. Well, guess what? I always tell people, God is not as interested in changing your circumstances and your situations as much as he is, is, is into changing your character and who you are. Once your character changes and you become a better person, then you will be smart enough and strong enough to handle what your life is really supposed to have. So if you can't do that, then you're not going to have anything great in life. So today, the, the main thing of today I want to tell you is, number one, stop complaining. Don't open your mouth to complain about anything. Your eyes, your eyes, your vision, the picture that you see in your head has to outweigh what your eyes see in this world. Your picture has to be big enough and bright enough and great enough for you to not look at what you're going through. You look at what your vision tells you and then that's what you focus on. And when you do that, guess what? You won't open your mind to complain because you know your vision is greater than what you see today. So don't complain and look deep. Look deep inside every situation and see what you can pull out of that that's good. And when you start doing that, guess what? Your life is going to start getting better. So trust me, I'm a person who went through it and still go through it. There's no such thing as a negative. Everything in your life can be a positive. It's just all about how you look at it, okay? So, you know, we're going to hit this gym a little later. I get a, a video showing you kind of what workout we're doing. And uh, I hope this message really, really gets to you. And don't let it go in one ear and out the other. Really pay attention because it's going to bless your life. All right? I'm out of here. I'm going to go hit this gym. Peace out. Bye.